Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan and today I will be talking about Virtual overdose monitoring may help reduce opioid deaths. Now since 1999, more than 9 lakh people have died from a drug overdose. Now in 2020, close to 92,000 drug overdose deaths even occurred. The rate of these overdose deaths has increased by 31% from 2019 to 2020. Now, virtual overdose monitoring is a concept that has the potential to actually reduce the risk of deaths from opioids and various other kinds of substances by offering timely as well as anonymous access to emergency care. Now, this study is published in the Canadian Medical Association Journal. Isolation and solitary use of opioids and other substances are the main driver of overdose deaths as people are unable to seek help immediately. So virtual overdose monitoring using phone lines or even smartphone apps can connect people anonymously with people who can actually develop personalized emergency response plans and even supervise the substance use. These services operate 24 hours a day and have no restrictions on the type of substances or how they are used. So this virtual overdose monitoring services, they are novel public health interventions which are quite capable of actually providing timely and accessible harm reduction and overdose prevention services for people who use substances. So evidence suggests that virtual overdose monitoring services have promise as an adjunct to supervised consumption services in the continuum of care for people who use such substances. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.